Hi Aries, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Aries, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Aries. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Ace of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy, so this is a very solid offer that's being made. This is something you can really trust and count on. This is, it, it looks like someone could be wanting to invest in, in a new beginning with you, and there's something solid about their word. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Death card in the reverse, Scorpio Energy, the Seven of Swords in the reverse, air energy and the sun leo energy yeah it looks like someone you know uh because you have this death card it's like there, there's someone who's coming back around and they want to make you a solid offer this time um this person wants to be more transparent they there's a feeling of them expressing their truth to you being very genuine and authentic with you confessing their feelings and um it looks like this person wants to be with you they see you as a source of light in their life you're a source of joy and they want to make you happy they want to heal together you know this is someone who in the past they may have been a little bit more closed off or aloof or they were wearing some sort of a mask here where they didn't really lead with their true intentions and they this time around they want to lead with their true intentions let's clarify these cards uh aries Okay, so we have the Knight of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is, again, they're coming towards you with a solid offer. There could also be an apology here, but this is someone who wants to be seen as a stand-up person. Like, they want to, you know, come with good, down-to-earth, pure intentions. This is someone who also wants to prove themselves through their actions. You know, they want you to trust them. Okay, so let's see. You have the Two of Swords, Air Energy, the World, Fixed Sign Energy, and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. So you could have closed yourself off to this person. You know, with the Two of Swords, you, you may even feel a little bit suspicious when they come towards you with this offer. You know, this is someone you, you have your guard up to them. You know, you've had a history with them. And them coming towards you may actually put you in a state where you are feeling a little bit unsure about what to do. And there's this feeling of putting off making a decision. Um, but this person will give you clarity. They'll even give you closure on something. You know, there's something about you guys having had this cycle. And they weren't very honest with you in the past. And they want to be more revealing, more more truthful, more transparent. And I, I do see it giving you closure regarding a past cycle that you had with them. And this can help you move forward. It looks like you guys will be getting on the same page and overcoming a, an obstacle and um, finding some sort of resolution to something. But ultimately, it looks like the, it will be the ball is in your court here, whether you, you and this person have another chance, a new beginning. Um, because it looks like they, they're putting that on you. Um, they, they, they're putting the ball in your court. This is someone who is presenting you with an offer. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Aries. Okay, so we have Expect Powerful Change, New Moon Eclipse. Okay, 
Okay, we have love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So this person does see you though as someone who respects themselves and someone who they have to come correct towards. So they do want to show you that they, they honor you and that they've changed. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so we have false indigo, immersion and intuition. When you reach the end of what you should know, you will be at the beginning of what you should sense. Okay, so you're definitely being advised to trust your intuition, um, you know, act from a place of self-love. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Aries. Okay, we have surrender procrastination. Now is the time to jump on a goal instead of putting it off. Taking action will attract success. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Aries. I hope you have a really, really good day, Aries. Bye, Aries.